businesses are on high alert tonight in a popular Little Rock neighborhood after multiple run-ins with a man police banned from a shop in the Heights. Little Rock police have been called here to Cantrell and R Street multiple times. Our Haley Brooks joining us now live with what business owners are saying about the situation out there. What's going on? Businesses, businesses here have either seen this man, spoken to him, or at the very least, they've heard what's going on, and they all plan on keeping an eye out for him and for each other. By day, this parking lot has a steady flow of people going in and out of various businesses. Little Rock police say one man is continuing to show up on the department's radar with five police reports filed in the last month. Board and Brush is one business that hasn't filed a report yet, but the owner, Shelly Brardy, says they're keeping a watchful eye. A name has been identified, um, a vehicle has been identified, and to, you know, just to be um, aware um, and to call the police if you are concerned. But a few doors down is a different story. In one report, a man was asked to leave Zen Studio, but according to the report, he refused. Police say several letters were sent to him asking him not to return, saying he was banned from the property, but he still showed up. Now some businesses are on guard and Berardi says it's a good reminder to always be aware of your surroundings. I just think these things can happen anywhere. Um, it doesn't matter if you're in small town America or in the middle of New York City. Um, things happen all the time and so we just have to remember to, you know, just remind ourselves just to, just to be aware. Right now, Little Rock police do not believe that this man is dangerous, and there are no criminal charges filed against him. Still, some of the businesses here are updating their safety protocol. Reporting live in Little Rock, I'm Haley Brooks. Back to you.